Hey guys, this is Rosa Kelly. Today I'm here to share with you a new project, so let's take a look. So hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to give you a walkthrough of this trifle mini album. This is quite a chunky one and I am using the Christmas Spectacular Collection by 49 and Market. And this is one of my class kits. So you can find the kits and the class on my website. I'm going to have it linked down below. We have here a large trifle mini album and this album measures eight and a quarter by six and a half and it has a three inch spine three and a half inch spine and it has three different sections full of different features so yeah let's take a look here on the cover so the kit came with a collection of little um chipboard frames so i am using one of those chipboard frames here on the cover and the pearls are also part of your kit and then the flowers as well and so again really really fun to play with we have the 49 and market collection as well as a 12 by 12 complementary background set as well and so yeah so now here is the spine i just love this design here and then here is the back that's how that looks like now let's take a look inside this book and so as we open here the center um, we have another one of those frames I just want to show you how many <laughs> frames you get on the kit so I still have quite a lot and so what I intend to do is to add another frame here and then just kind of add another flower and just decorate these a little bit more now I show you on the tutorial that it's a lot easier to put the frame at the same time as you're adding the picture that's why I'm kind of just um, I did this one as a demo and I added a couple more but I'm leaving some blank as well uh, so this opens up here again to on this side so here you can see the other one so this I backed on one of the uh, complementary backgrounds and this one I just backed on white cardstock so just to kind of show you how they'll look um, but again it'll be much easier to just Put the picture right away in, in you'll be like jumping a step uh, but anyway so let's take a look at this side here so this opens up and it opens here again and on the center we have again place for pictures this opens up and then this opens down here and over here we have a waterfall and so this waterfall actually is a pocket waterfall so each one of these pieces is a large pocket so you can add another full size photo mat in there and each one of these is the same so I'm just gonna take this one out and then this also opens here to the side so you have more room for different size pictures there as well and then we're going to close that up and then over on this side here we have a little gateful page so this opens and opens place for a picture right there and then this opens up uh, let me do this here so this opens up here first and then we have a platform page and this opens to the side and then this opens one more time and then we have a pocket here and I forgot about this <laughs> section here so I didn't put anything on the pocket uh, but you can see how you have a lot of room for pictures and then this closes um, here first and then this closes right there and it magnetizes in place um, then we move to the center which is my favorite uh, section of this book and again another one of those frames I just decorated with some little tickets these are cut apart from one of the sheets on the collection that had like little ephemera and so I use that here and then we have a flower and then this opens up and it opens down and so this kind of like pinkish um, watercolor paper is the complementary background which is from I believe scrap and me is the 
um, the designer for that collection but it really matches the um, the colors of the collection that we're using um, here we have this page that opens up like that and this is actually a gatefold that opens this way and it opens again here so it opens both ways revealing the center and so on the center here we have one of these little spinning uh, features and this is a 3d kind of like a carousel uh, photo display so this opens here and it opens here and then again it opens and opens so you can add all your pictures here on the inside and then this will spin around that way you can kind of just see all your images from the same place now this also opens to the side and then we have here a pocket and just some of the cut parts from the collection there and then this whole thing also opens down and then place for picture pictures and then this opens to the side and it opens to the side again so this is just some solid white cardstock that i use to complement and this is that water po uh, watercolor page and then this closes here and then down here we have a secret pull down page so we have a pocket here holding this section and it opens up like that and this as you can see is attached to the book so it's just like a little um pull down like a little secret that you can hide in there and then these two closes up like that and then these um, closes here and here and then we're gonna move to this right side here so um, i have not finished uh, with this side like adding the paper because i ran out of magnets and so i'm still waiting for that before i finish all the pages like this is kind of wobbly here because i need to add my magnets back here and i left this open to add my magnets um but i just wanted to <laughs> make the video and share with you because i just can't wait anymore <laughs> and so i love how this turned out so this is going to open up and down here i did a little collage and then this this layout is also really fun because here we have an easel page so this opens up like that and then this is also a pocket back here and then this also opens up this way so when we open it this way we have a double pop-up page here so again i still need to add magnets on this side here to keep that close um, but this opens and opens so you can add pictures over there uh, pictures back here like that and then of course on the bottom and here i mean you can just fill this up with pictures and it's just so so fun and it's a uh, fun technique to do so of course on the class i go step by step on how you can make these and it is a lot easier than what you think super super fun to make and i just really love the pop-up <laughs> statement on this page here again this is wobbly because i still need to add my magnets on the back but then this also opens this way and this is just a blank layout here where i'm gonna add a picture uh, i'm sorry a magnet <laughs> and then this also slides so we have a double sliding page and then this opens here and it opens again here so this is the part where i need to um, add magnets back here and then that way when we close this we'll connect the magnets there and then same thing here we'll connect the magnets here and here so i have not finished those but i do have some more of my like background papers to finish decorating that page and i even have like this little piece cut here so i can just glue that right there after i add my magnets um but i love this like the whole book it was so fun to make a lot of interactive features i just try to put a lot of different ones and just kind of so there you go them. that is the christmas spectacular um trifold album i hope that you guys enjoy the walkthrough again i'm gonna have the link to my website down below you can find the kits and the class or you can also find the video class available um by itself as well and yeah i want to thank you guys so so much for watching and i will see you on the next one bye bye